What's up guys, Biddy here, and today I have a different video for you all. I'm playing with a Smash player some of you may not have heard of, but um, yeah, I've decided to like talk to uh, different Smash players from time to time and uh, you get have you get to learn about them and know who they are. But first off, for this time, I'm having a friend of mine speak... Blah, I can't even talk right now. Introduce yourself. What's going on, guys? I'm Circa Pow Pow. I'm currently number one on the Wisconsin PR, and I'm a Sonic man, of as you tell, as I go fast around the stage. <laughs> yes, uh, yes, yeah, Circa Pow Pow, uh, sponsored by Circa Esports. Yeah. yeah, they were, they're a pretty small organization, but they've been growing a lot lately, like, oh, yeah. as recently signed 6WX, I was a big guest for them. Yeah, definitely been putting in a lot of work, and like, see, like I, I hung out with a few of them at uh, Genesis. They're cool guys. Definitely an organization you should check out. I have the links to them, their Twitter and Pow Pow's Twitter. But uh, yeah, uh, why don't you just talk a little bit about yourself? All right. Um, right now I'm my first year of college at the University of Wisconsin Lacrosse, and um, I've been active in the SMAP scene for I'd say since like late July. Oh, okay. Like, I, yeah. It's not very long. Yeah. And like, because I, I just found out like about tournaments around me like about that time. Otherwise, I was more I was mostly a Wi-Fi warrior for a long time. Yeah. Panthers ladder. Oh, okay, gotcha. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, like, the, well, what did I just do? I just, I guess, I think I tried to like hop off on the ledge. You just instantly footstool me. <laughs> yeah. Word. Okay. Yeah. But uh, wait, what is your name? Because I don't even know your your actual first name. Oh, Reed. Oh, oh like yeah, R oh yeah, oh yeah. Like read book, R E D. Yeah, yeah, gotcha, gotcha. But uh, like the only one that doesn't have an I instead of an E. <laughs> That's like me with my name. Like my name is Dylan, but yeah. I'm but I'm D I L L O N. Oh yeah, I feel you. Yeah, so yeah, not the standard, but uh, nonetheless, um, okay, I'm just gonna ask you a few questions, have people get to know you and whatnot, and then we're gonna just randomly play and see what the fuck happens. All right. Also, good. also you could curse too if you if, yeah, if, if you were concerned. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I just kind of assumed, but like, Yeah, I got you, got you. I just hold off just to make sure. Alright, got you. Alright, so first question. Uh, how did you get into competitive Smash? Um, my brother, he was a sophomore at his college, and they actually started competitive tournaments at the University of Wisconsin Platteville, shout out to them. Oh, wow. And so, like, he, like, started finding out about tournaments in Wisconsin. Like, I had no idea up to that point. Mm -hmm. And, like, I was just playing a lot of, like, online that like I never really like had people around me that were like as good as me when I played so like I wanted to always find new people to play with so through that like I found out about tournaments in my area and then I finally went to one late late July mm -hmm. and I've been going to them ever since so nice yeah that's that's cool that's cool um okay so how did you come up with the tag pow pow Alright, so that one, it was like a combination of two things, um, back when, for Xbox 360, like, you know how you had to, like, pay for an online account, mm. and, like, how many hours a month, so, yeah. me and my brother shared an account, and, like, I don't know, so we ended up picking the name Pow Pow Beatdown, because, like, my last name's Powell. Okay. So then I, I took that along with, like, a lot of my friends just called me Pow Pow, so I just took that and ran with it. Gotcha. And it just kind of stuck, and a lot of people like it. Something different. Yeah, yeah, it, it, it's... It's not like, like it's not like no Falco Falco Allegiance guy to X one two four nine. Falco Master sixty nine. <laughs> oh my Fox. lord! Oh my god! <laughs> right? Okay, I cannot tell you how many times I've played on Anthers Ladder and someone's name is like Sonic Unleashed and they play Mario. I... It happens a lot, <laughs> and it bothers me like, so I much. Like I think there was a guy like Mr. Earthbound or whatever, and he played freaking uh, Jigglypuff. And I was Bruh. like really confused. <laughs> oh my god. No, nah, but that's cool. That's definitely a better story than uh, my my how I came up with my tag, but that's for a different time. <laughs> Alright, I was, was kind of curious about that, uh, about that later. You, no, fuck it. I, was, I, I mean, I, I don't think I've really talked about it in a video, but uh, oh, really? I, I used to be an Xbox guy myself, big Call of Duty guy, before I got into Smash. I, my gamer tag was Dynamite41. Dino M I G H T 41. Stupid, I know. I was like. Yeah. <laughs> I was like 12 or something, but uh, yeah, um, I was I didn't like the name and my clan buddies weren't the, like they didn't like it either or whatever. But so they're like, I right, we're gonna like they're like, I right, we don't like your name and I know you don't we know you don't either. So 
sometime this week we're gonna we're gonna come up with a new name for you. I'm like, oh, okay. And then one day I I was at, I was at track practice and I came yeah. home. And all my I joined the Xbox Live party with all my buddies and they're like, I'm like, yo, and they go, Biddy. I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> They're like, yo, that's your new name. I'm like, I, okay. I'm, I was like, what the fuck does that even mean? He's like, well, he's like, you always talk about girls and shit, and like, and we just think it, we said, oh, oh shit. <laughs> shit, I rarely I was ever not get ready the reverse, for that. I, yeah, I rarely ever get the reverse hitbox, but that was. Uh, anyway, so, that, so but, that's how you got the uh, but, uh, but, uh, but like I was like I don't like I don't know what they were talking about like I barely, like they were they were weird guys I don't fuck <laughs> them anymore. But, oh. but nonetheless, um, they called me Biddy. I was like whatever. Like it stuck for a little bit with them, and then uh like my uh what's it called I wanted to get into YouTube and stuff. I got I did YouTube before Smash Brothers, and. Yeah, I think I stumbled upon your channel the other day. Oh, yeah? <laughs> it's like Biddy... Biddy something LPs or something like that. Yo, yo Biddy LPs. Yes. Yeah, that was my old channel. Yeah. And then I made yes. a new one, but that's for... That's a different story. But, uh, nonetheless... Um... Oh, fuck. I heard super saying percent shit. Oh, never mind. Oh, I forget what... <laughs> okay, um... Fuck, what was, I lost track. So it came I'm out, talking it came, about old YouTube channel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but, yeah, but so it came to time to make a YouTube channel. And I'm about like 16 at this time, and I was like, yeah. fuck, fuck, I don't like, uh, I don't like, I want, I want to use Dino Mike 41 as <laughs> yeah. my YouTube name is stupid. And then like, this was like, before, like one of the few like last time, like a lot of the times in the Skype calls, like once they call me Biddy, I would go Yo, and they go Biddy. <laughs> and like it like it just became a thing. Like don't don't, yeah. don't ask me why. But anyways, um Hey Oh Oh <laughs> damn it. Oh fuck. I just wanted to off the top kill as soon as possible. <laughs> okay. No, I feel you. Hold on, this this is fucking intense. Hey oh, fuck. Up Smash Boys. Ah But um <laughs> <laughs> So like I was like, huh, yo biddy. So it said oh, okay, So I sense. came up with the, I so I made my first channel, Yo Biddy forty one. And then, like, I had complications with that channel, so I made Yo Biddy and put LPs because I did the place and stuff. That was my main thing. Yeah, yeah. And then that, like, I did that for a few years, and then I clearly, and then I had, like, copyright problems and, like, inactiveness, and I didn't do videos for, like, over a year, and I wanted a fresh start, so I made Biddy Bits, and that's my current channel. Yeah. And then, and then when I go to tournaments, I don't feel like, I didn't feel like just using Yo Biddy, so I just went by Biddy in tournaments. Yeah, I feel you. Like, but now that that story is out of the way, <laughs> um, yeah. back to you. Um, so, how did you do like in like your first few tournaments, like actual like, like, in, yeah, local yeah. tournaments, I should say. Right. So like the first tournament, like, I guess like, the first one I went to, like, I went to one at Platteville and I placed first there. But then like my first like all paid tournament I went to outside of Platteville was was a construct in Milwaukee, and I actually got second. Uh. So, like, because, I mean, I'd been playing the game, like, competitively for a long time. At that point, I just hadn't been to a tournament. Yeah. So, like, when I got there, I was, I took out a lot of, like, uh, Wisconsin PR players, and it, it, it went really well, like, and that's kind of become a trend lately in Wisconsin, is, um, um, answers ladder players coming in and shitting on everyone, and then, like, getting top, top five. Mm -hmm. So, I kind of started that trend early on, Word. and then, and then I just kept kept it going. Like, I've never besides um, you know what Kings of the North was? Kings of what? Kings of the North. I don't think so. It was it was a tournament in um Wisconsin in November. It was like Fallen was there and oh, okay. uh, MJG. But like besides besides that tournament, I've never placed outside of um top three in Wisconsin tournament. Oh okay. Wait, so, uh, like, wait uh, where was that one tournament dismantle? Where was that at? Cause where you? Oh, at that, that was in that was Chicago. Oh, okay, were well, you at that? Yeah, I was at it. Oh, okay, how'd you do? I there? got, I did, I got the two seed out of my pool, but then I got them. Um, <laughs> of course. I got the two seed out of my pool, but then I won two in brackets, so I got thirty third because it was top sixty four. Oh, gotcha. That's cool. Yeah, like I had a really close set with you know who low one is. Oh yeah, the uh, is he Luigi. Yeah, he's um I think he's number two in Michigan right now. Luigi's it went so to game cool. three. Luigi's so annoying. Oh yeah, I mean like even after the nerf, he's still he's still pretty good. Oh yeah. But, like I can respect Luigi players now, but like 
But like, yeah, so in that set, um, I went to game three, and I didn't realize that Luigi's down smash can stage spike you. Oh, okay. So I like, I was holding on the ledge, and I grab, I grabbed off into like an up air or something under the ledge, like sharking. Mm -hmm. So then he down smashed me, oh, and I fuck. died. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, okay. Game more. I was, I was kind of just like, <laughs> I was kind of half paying attention. But um, yeah, I got you. And so like. So then I, I didn't, I wasn't prepared, so I didn't tech it, and so I died at like 50, 60, Damn. and I just couldn't catch up. That's and then, nice. in Losers, I forgot that on Smashville, Ness, you know, like at 0%, he can oh down throw you forward. God. He carried me onto the platform, and I died at 10. Yep, that's happened to me before, too. <laughs> he, like, he would down throw forward air, grab, fuck it, yeah. throw forward throw, dead. Uh, yeah, I should, I, 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 I rolled backwards, and I killed me. <laughs> and so like, sucks. and so that I, I mean I was pretty tilted that whole game and I was, but then game two I I was I brought it back and it was really close, mm -hmm. and um but then I got lilatted. Mm, no fun. And like I mean he was a good player. He's number eleven in Chicago right now, but Word. but it was just like I was just so mad because yeah, I it's I, understandable. I I have a problem with that where like if I at big tournaments I seem to like lose back to back sets. Mm -hmm. Like, I'll, I'll, like, I'll do really well, and then all of a sudden I just lose back to back, because that's and it just frustrates me. I got you. Yeah, that happened to Kings of the North, too, where, like, I, I lost to Fallen in Winners. Like, I got bodied really hard, because I just, like, I didn't know there was a winner matchup. Yeah. And then, and, and that was the plan to get Winner's side top 8. And then, um, loser side, I played against the Bowser Jr., which I've never played that matchup in my life, and it sucks ass for Sonic. Mm. So like I just wasn't ready and I got bopped. I mean I, I have a better handle on it now, but back then I was like I had no idea. Oh I had something out of kill. <laughs> but yeah, so but, and then I haven't really been able to go to as many turns as I would like just because of like school and traveling and yeah, stuff. Yeah, it's understandable. So I usually only make it to like one or two a month. Mm -hmm. That's why like when I'm older I wanna like live near a big city and yeah, try yeah, to get yeah. to like weekly and stuff. Yeah, exactly. That's Dream cool. scenario. Wait, sorry, what were you saying? No, 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 go on, go on. I don't know if you're finished. Dream scenario, I moved to Florida and I can attend versus and stuff like that. Oh, okay. Because I'd like to work for like Disney or something like that. Oh, word. For, in their marketing department. It's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, oh yeah, so what were you saying? No, I was just gonna ask another question. Uh, so what got you, what made you want to play Sonic? Um, Sonic's my favorite video game character, like, him and Tails, both. And, like, when, once, when, I would, the ha one of the happiest moments of my life was when, um, they announced Sonic for Brawl. Oh, God. I, I remember, um, I mean, I'm, I'm not saying I probably, like, one of the highlights of my life, but, like, just, like, from childhood, childhood things, you know what I mean. Yeah, no, I feel you, I feel you. And, like, so... In the video, I, the video game aspect. Yeah, Aha, yeah, exactly. boomer, Boomerang is big. Yeah, it is. And so, like... I just remember running down to my home computer and checking that, and I was I was just so happy. And like, I didn't play Brawl competitively, but like, I use Sonic all the time. Oh yeah. And so then, I I got into competitive stuff for Smash Four, and it just so happened that he's way better in this game. So yeah, right. I got lucky that way. That's good. That's good. What? So okay. What is your on that note? What is your favorite and least favorite Sonic game? Okay. Um. Okay, favorite is actually really hard. Like, I, there aren't really many Sonic games I don't like, and I, I don't really, I don't know if I can really pick a favorite. Like, to be honest, I've never played. I, I have played them, but I haven't played through them all the way. Like the good ones, like Sonic, Sonic Three, with Knuckles, and that sort of thing. Yeah. Like, I just play like the modern Sonic stuff. I, I pretty much like most of them except for um, Sonic Six, obviously. And Sonic, yeah. I mean, like the thing is with Sonic Six is like. It actually had some good things going for it, but it just wasn't finished. Oh fuck, that hey. And um, <laughs> but like where Sonic Boom has literally like no redeeming qualities whatsoever, <laughs> because it's like it's boring. The dialogue is horrible. Yeah. It, the direction of the game makes no sense. It's right. glitchy, <laughs> and it, it doesn't know what it wants to be. Sometimes it's a platformer. Sometimes it's a crawler. <laughs> sometimes it just, yeah. It's a mess. Indeed. No, I feel that. It was funny. I, I, yeah. No, I used to work at a GameStop. That's those are dark times. But <laughs> Sonic Generations came out recently, and yeah. a kid came up to the register and he he was like, "Is this the new Sonic game?" And he put out Sonic 06. Yeah. 
No, no. I'm like, um, here, I, no. put the, I like threw that in the back, and I'm like, here, come with me, and I, and I brought him, got him generation, well, I didn't buy it, but like, showed him generation, yeah. said he got that, and it was pretty, so that was, the oh, high, yeah. that was the highlight of my GameStop career, but that only lasts, oh, like, yeah. that only lasts like three months until I quit. Oh, yeah. I'd probably say my three favorite Sonic games are, um, Sonic Adventure 2, Sonic Generations, and Sonic Colors. Oh, yeah, okay. Is I'm one... playing, what, what's up? No, no, you go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> I'm playing through uh, Sonic Lost World right now. Oh, Lord. And, like, I'm usually, I try to go into every Sonic game with an open mind. And, um, I mean, it's okay, but there are a lot of things where I'm just like, <laughs> Exactly, yeah. <laughs> because, yeah. like, I don't know, it's, there's a lot of stuff where it's, like, it's, like, interesting. Like, they did some good stuff while I'm getting bodied right now. <laughs> um, and, but, like, Sonic's so slow compared to how he usually is. I think it's, like, hey. a bug. And, um, and the ice levels, holy shit, they're bad. They're uh, so bad. I, I remember I got friggin' uh, Lost World uh, used on the 3DS, and I returned it the same day. Bruh. <laughs> and, like, so, like, I made it through the ice world, I'm like, okay, I can do this. And, um, then I got to, I, I'm like, Silent Forest or something like that. Oh, fuck. Okay. And, um... Then there's another ice level, and I just I just stopped playing. I haven't finished the game yet. <laughs> <laughs> Understandable. I couldn't do it. Like there was one part where I just I, I just I, I just turned off the game. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. You, you, I'm you sorry. wanted it. I'm you sorry. I'm it. sorry. I wanted that so bad. <laughs> okay. Not. Okay. Uh, now I need to body you because I I just got that for free. Hey. No, but you know what? It's fun. it's weird. You know what? Like probably what is like my top five favorite uh, Sonic game, which a lot of people would disagree with. Yeah. Black Knight. Oh, dude, that game's dope. Yeah, right? Like, like, I first time, first, like, when I first heard of that, I'm like, Sonic's a fucking knight? That is awesome. Oh, no. Okay, I goodbye. I landed. Goodbye. <laughs> uh, I thought I landed. Fair yeah. enough. No, but okay. I don't know why I thought that game was, like, so, like, the shit. <laughs> oh, dude, that game was fun as fuck. Yeah, it's, and also, Sonic Colors is up there. Yeah. I didn't really play much of the class. I mean, the only time I really played like the classics is when I when I was way young and I went to the dentist. There was a little arcade thing for Sonic One. Yo, that's dope. <laughs> that was my shit. <laughs> and I I had it on my iPod Touch, so I would play the first one a lot on there. Ah, gotcha. <laughs> and then I kept getting to like it was like World Three or Four, and I kept drowning, and I was like, yeah, I'm done. <laughs> oh fuck that. No, but that's cool. All right. So next question: How did you and Circa Esports become a thing? Um, w they actually contacted me on Twitter. Wow. Like, I started my, uh, Smash Twitter, and it was, like, early February, and, like, no, no not February, of uh, September, like, okay. of last year. Gotcha. And so then, like, they just got in contact with me, or, like, asked, like, what my tournament results were like, so I just sent them some challenge brackets of, like, Constructs in Milwaukee, and then, like, Minnesota Monthly, as I'd been to, and yeah. we just, they said they're interested in signing me, so I got together with them. Nice. And like, I were never you, like... Were you, were you the first Smash player on the team? No, they already had two beforehand. They had, um, Arakai and Warchief. Okay. Oh, yeah. So the, you... Yeah. Both, they were both California players. And so like, they, I think they're looking to like branch out for some other oh, parts of state. Yes, got it. <laughs> there you go. And so, um... Yeah, they, they added me in. So like, then they added 6 WX after that. Yeah, so you're basically the Sonic team. Yeah, basically. And, and like... We get asked that all the time, like, does Circo only, uh, sign Sonic? And no, so I'm like, no, they have a Falco player, and right. I have to say it every time. Right. Because people just don't remember, like, people don't remember Warchief, and I feel bad, so I always have to, like, I, I, remind people. I saw, I saw him at, uh, Genesis, he's pretty cool and good. Yeah, I mean, he made round two. I, I, well, I, yeah, right, I made the, I, well, I am a fan of the Falco matchup, because I play a lot with, the uh, Kitaro. Oh, yeah. And, like, well... Out of the last ten matches, ten sets we played, I'm nine and uh, nine and one versus him. Who got him? Yeah. yeah. I mean, he's probably the best Falco right now. Oh, I mean, yeah. I, I, I don't know if that's much of an argument. Yeah, right. No, he's probably one of the best Falcos right now. It's just like when I got those wins on, he just had zero idea of how to fight Toon Link. And the thing is, I, I have a different Toon Link than others. I would say I'm really aggressive. Oh yeah, I can do that. Yeah. Do you have uh, any Toon Links in Wisconsin? We actually um. There is one guy, Dro, who plays Toon Link as well as like Diddy Kong and Chi. And then we had um our one of our top guys in the state get upset by a Toon Link oh. um last weekend. So 
Two, two ink invasions happening. Gotcha. Basically, after Genesis, that's basically what it's gonna yeah. be. I mean, like, I personally always thought Team Link was like, I mean, I, not always, but like for a while I thought Team Link's like borderline top tier. Mm -hmm. And like, Hugo was showing that that's probably the case. Oh, yeah. Oh, I wanted this. I've been playing, <laughs> not fair. I've, I've been playing uh, Toon Link since Brawl. Oh, nice. Yeah. yeah. So, I'm definitely the loyalist. <laughs> yeah. I, and, like, I don't, there's nothing wrong with like taking okay. character just because they're good, but like, Depending on the character, sometimes I'd be like, hey, I've played this character since forever. Yeah, right? Yeah. But, uh, yeah, that's cool. Uh, do you have any secondaries? I do. I've been working on my Ryu for the last, oh, like, yeah, yeah. couple weeks. And, um, and I also just picked up Mario, because he's Mario and he's easy. Exactly. exactly. <laughs> like, that, that's... That's, there's no, there's sort of no other reason I picked him up. Yeah, and, like, I, 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 I used I to play him early reason. on, but... I have the same reasoning. He's just very And, cool. like, the thing is with, like... I don't know if I'll actually ever use them that often in bracket, mm -hmm. but I basically just use that as a way to like learn the game better because Sonic's so different from every other character. Yeah. That like whenever I would try to play other characters, it just like I was awful. Like I couldn't <laughs> play other characters. Don't I've been me. I've been probably through like fifteen secondaries. Yeah, like I didn't really like have a secondary at all until fucking. Oh shit! Oh, you almost <laughs> the, got it. The accidental footstools. But um, I didn't really have a secondary since until the DK patch. Oh yeah, and I was like, you know what? This seems easy and simple yeah. and, and good. I'll try it out. I think that's how a lot of secondaries are. Is like, is it easy or do you actually want to like? I, cause, I mean, it depends on the character. Like, sometimes you really don't need one. Yeah, you you so would just, you, you would take yeah. me here. I yeah, I would. God, it's, it's my favorite place to take projectile characters. Yeah, just now, to fuck with them. Oh uh, yeah, right. You, now uh, another question. Uh, who are some of your other favorite Sonic mains to watch? Well, six of you actually. Yeah, <laughs> but do you watch like any others in particular? Oh yeah, I, I watch a lot of Sonic players just like to gain new ideas. Like usually, I can watch like one set and like pick up one new thing. Usually, like most often, I watch a lot of Seagull Joe, Six yeah. WX, um, Hero. I also um, you know, like cause I I'm part of like a Sonic group chat in um the Midwest and. Uh, one of the guys introduced me to um, a guy from well, my dad. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit! Dude, I'm just a, I'm just a hedgehog. Anyway, um, <laughs> so there's a guy from New England named Craftus who's a oh, Sonic player that I was like, damn, this guy's movement's nuts. So I've been watching him. Yeah, he's he's really good. So I'm gonna have to check out more of his. I'm trying to think of some other players. Um, Ixis from Europe. Oh yeah, I've heard of Ixis. Uh, I I I drove him. Uh, Jay Miller. And like a couple other European players, I forget who they were, but uh, to uh, Apex. Yeah. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Yeah, it's like that's gotta be nice living on the East Coast because you like you, there's so many like more players you can be in contact with. Yeah. Probably like the best Sonic player in my area. I like have played well two, but one of them dropped Sonic. Um, blue. Well, blue, yeah, but he yeah he's a Mewtwo player now. Yeah, which like how how often does that happen, like bro? <laughs> you see you well you see he beat Nairo. Yeah, I did. I was like, holy I, I, shit. I, I was at that tournament. I got fourth in that tournament. Just, oh, yeah, I saw that. Because I was, I was pissed. Because I, I, I was in loser semi, so I'm like, alright, Blue's probably going to lose to Nairo, so I'm going to probably play Blue again. <laughs> and of course, he beats them, so I had to play Nairo in loser semis. Yeah, that's us. <laughs> but... Oh, no. Thank you, dog. <laughs> dog, the real MVP. But, uh, all, real MVP, also, yeah. uh, but really, the main Sonic I play is uh, Camelange. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I've, I've talked to him quite a bit. Yeah, he's a cool Oh, no. Guy. Am I dead? Bruh! Where, where's your back throw now? Nestor, <laughs> Nestor Toon Link? I don't know. <laughs> Can't tell. Nah, Ness is freaking ridiculous. Yeah, Camel is super cool. <laughs> Alright, All right, we're probably gonna play one more and I'm gonna like wrap this up. Alright, sounds good. Uh, yeah. I'm trying to think of like other stuff. I basically covered like all the main. Uh, okay, what is. Who was like your favorite like person to play against or like your favorite like w tournament win? In general. Um, oh yeah, favorite tournament win would have to be, um, DJ Demidas, do you know who that is? I think so, who does he play? Uh, he plays Captain Falcon and Knight. Okay, M I might have heard of him. Yeah. He's from the Chicago area, he got 17th that big house. Oh, okay, alright, yeah. if if I'm better with, like, watching gameplay and shit, so I I've probably, like, yeah, yeah. probably seen him around, because I watch a lot of matches. Yeah, he got 17th at big house, then I think 25th at MLG. Mm -hmm. And so, like, at King of the North, like, that was my first, like, big tournament with out-of-state people. Yeah. And, um, so I played him in pools, because, like, I don't know, like, we, we were both considered to be, like, we, 
supposed to be considered a one of our pool, and that was like a big set. Yeah. And um, so like, I guess I guess he has he didn't really uh, n have much experience in the Sonic matchup, so I just I kind of because especially since I play Falcons all the time, I just, I just knew what to do in the matchup, and I was able to double two sock him. Oh shit. So like, and especially like at a big tournament where like there's a big crowd and that sort of thing, so yeah. it was cool to have like the home state behind me. Mm -hmm. So that's probably what, like my favorite memory. Right. Mine would probably have to be like Kitaro, a mix between Kitaro ribs. Oh yeah, ribs. Uh, the ribs. Yeah. Dude, like he. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, I love I love doing that. <laughs> yeah, <I know. laughs> but uh. Just yeah. Rib, it was, you know, he wanted me to like, he called me, uh, at Genesis, he called me and was like looking for me, and like, like he was like, yo, I need you to friggin', because he was about to play, I don't know if you heard of a Toon Link player, 3XA? I have not. Oh, he's a really campy Toon Link player, and he like needed me to like coach him and shit, and it was fucking painful to watch, because I hate, yeah. like, hate campy Toon Links. He, yeah. literally, he literally took him to Duck Hunt Game 3, and like, literally boomerang arrow, boomerang bomb, bomb, boomerang bomb. So he just like stood there and watched him while I did things? Yeah, yeah, well, like, I taught, like, he was like, alright, how do I, how am I gonna fight this guy? I'm like, alright, do you know how about how I play, and when we play? He's like, yeah, I'm like, alright, exact opposite. <laughs> he's like, bro. He's like, dude. I'm like, that's all. That's all I can say. Just watch out for your and... That's how I felt like when I, cause I, I was playing. I played a little one, and, and then like yesterday, I was playing online with uh, Shell from Chicago. Oh, uh, uh, wait, Shell. Is, yeah. Who does he play? He plays Luigi. Oh, okay. Yeah. So like, trying to play against the campier Luigi and an aggressive Luigi is just like night and day. Oh my god. Yeah. Like the main. Yeah, I play like against a, a really aggressive Luigi. Uh, DMG James. Yeah, James good. Yeah, he's really like I. I'm probably gonna be seeing him like later today. We live like five minutes from each other. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, good. But like, ugh, he hates me. Hate he. He, <laughs> make, <laughs> he, ma he makes me uh, hate the matchup. Oh yeah, he's super yeah. good. Right. All right, but um, other than that, I think that's about gonna sum it up. Um, what, shout out like your Twitter, circa like all yeah. the all your shit real quick. Follow um circa esports on Twitter. I'll have, um, I'll, 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 I'll have the links to everything in the description, yeah. of course, but yeah. Also, you can follow me, Selfless Plugs, so they're gonna hey. pop out. <laughs> you gotta. Yes. I post uh, Sonic memes whenever I can. Of that, isn't that what all Sonic players do? Um, some more than others. <laughs> nah, I know, I'm kidding. Yeah, I know, I know what you mean. I mean, just like, that's to me, like, having a good, having a fun Twitter is just like with funny memes all the time, and that's what I prefer to do. Right, I, like, it's better to have that than like a boring freaking Twitter. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> but like, yeah. Oh no! That's not, oh god! I'm not <laughs> what I wanted to do to end it. Uh, Calcul Lord. Calculated. Right. <laughs> Red outplayed. Faded. Right. But uh, yeah. Uh, thank you for uh, taking the time. Oh wow! It's almost been a half hour. Jesus. Yeah, I blasted by fast. <laughs> right. <laughs> exactly. Especially when you're playing against Sonic. Oh yeah. But uh, yeah. Thank you for the games and thank you for the chatting. Yeah. yeah, thanks for having me on, man. Oh, no, of course. But yeah, guys, uh, I'm going to be doing this with a lot of other players in the future. I'm not really, I'm not going to do, like, all the time, like, ally, like, the top players that you know. I like, I like to, like, doing stuff like this with the good players that not many people know about. Like, from, the, like, different areas. Like, Wisconsin is not really a... Yeah, no, no, Wisconsin. <laughs> yes, exactly. So, expect, like, other various players of all kinds in the near future. But yeah, go check out uh, Circuit Esports, check out Pow Pow, all that. And yeah, thanks again, man. Alright, thanks, man. Appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. And, yeah, see, see you later, guys.